Hi there, welcome back to my channel. Okay, there. Just trying to adjust. Okay, so I'm um, just doing some playing. Um, I'm going to see if it works. Um, because I wanted to try these roses that um, have been going around Instagram and YouTube. Um, they look really cool. So um, I have black matted some nails and uh, now I'm just taking I may lead gel polish and this is their blossom base and it's in clear so just taking let's do I'm going to do the one nail so I'm just applying a fairly like not thin-ish, but not thick, like a medium even coat. Like you don't want too much. This stuff moves like it works really well. So I'm just applying a good coat. Oops, I've lost one of my nails already. Doesn't matter about those guys not at the moment so I'm just taking uh, number 11 which is white and it's I'm a Lee and I am just putting a blob of it on my tile like I don't need like a huge amount so Probably about this much. Now I'm taking one of my new brushes from nailstuff.ca. I'm probably taking this one. Oops. So my new brush from Nail Stuff with my name on it. Sorry, I just have to. I love these brushes. They're so cool. So I'm taking. It's not the super fine one. It's She's got four in this set, so this is number two. So, okay. So, as long as I'm in frame. So I'm just putting some on my brush. Now we have to work fairly quickly because this stuff moves. too slow. Just trying to get the hang of it. So basically I'm just making petals and I'm just going all over I know I'm being quiet, I'm sorry, but I'm just trying to do this fairly quickly. So as it spreads. So I'm just kind of doing the rose petals. And this tip's kind of long, so it'll look uh, weird at the bottom, but no biggie. So, okay, 
So I'm just going to go in and cure this for 60 seconds. Okay, hang on one minute. Okay, so I've cured that. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back in and kind of highlight a little bit on some of the just gonna got way too much of my brush here. And I'm just gonna highlight some of the areas. I want to be a little brighter. So let's take that up. So there's no real wrong or right. I don't think just whatever you like really so I'm not doing all of them I'm just kind of going through and making a few selects that are want them to kind of stand out a little more And then it's a couple of the, the extra bare spots I'm just kind of filling in a little bit. Okay. So now let me just cure this. And we'll be right back. Okay. So I'm back. And that's what it looks like so far. Okay. So now here's the fun part. Um, I'm going to color it in with alcohol inks and I was just kind of going through um, all the colors that I have and I definitely don't want a brown rose so I have blues or I have pink sorbet or wine gum I'm gonna, or wild plum I think I'm gonna try the wild plum so what I'm gonna do is oops figure out how to open it okay so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna put some oops on my tile oh. and now I'm taking um, my flat brush from nail stuff and I'm just gonna dip it in and I'm just gonna paint Rose. Oh, this looks awesome. Do you see this, guys? I'm so excited. Wow, this looks awesome. So, depending on how dark you want it, I think that's probably pretty good. Look at that. So I'm just going to let that dry for a minute and then we'll come in and top coat it. And um, that looks pretty cool for my first dry. Yeah, I'm liking that. Okay, one moment. Okay, so I'm back. And so now I'm going to go in with my Amelie and the white top coat should be dry now that looks really cool
I'll just kind of leave them lying around. Okay, so let me cure this and we'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back. And it looks pretty cool. I mean, not totally like a rose, but you know, for my first try, I think I did pretty darn good. Okay, so I'm just going to try another one and maybe we'll try blue this time. So, cool. Well, in a second, we'll try another.